In this video, I'm going to talk about managing complexity in the drawings that we've traced using image trace. So in earlier videos, we went through and got our fresco art, brought it into Adobe Illustrator, traced it using image trace, and now I'm left with a lot of anchor points. And I want to take care of some of that complexity because it's only going to cause difficulty in using pattern editing mode. It can slow down your system. So it's great to get rid of the anchor points before we start putting this into a pattern design. The two tools that I like to use for this process are the simplify feature that's included in Illustrator, or I use the Vector First Aid plugin by Astute Graphics. So I'm going to start by showing you Simplify inside of Illustrator. Right now I have an image right here. I'm going to get this out of the way, holding shift and just clicking my arrow key there to get that out of the way. And what I have here are these petals that I created in Fresco using a vector brush. So it's great. I didn't have to do any tracing with these, but if I switch to my white arrow, we can see there still are a lot of anchor points. And really there are more anchor points than is necessary to reproduce this art. So this is the time to clean them up and get rid of them. So I'm going to do that by going up to object, path, and simplify. And here we are in the simplify dialog box. Now the reason mine opens with all of this settings and sliders is because I have this box here checked. Retain my latest settings and directly open this dialog. Otherwise you'll see just sort of one little slider and it's pretty minimal. So we'll start with this and just right here, look, we've got 482 points in the original artwork. And right now, just with the settings I have here, we've got 151 anchor points. So there's no point in going around with art that has this many anchor points in it when it's this easy to come up with this many anchor points. And if I check and uncheck the preview box, I see the anchor points flashing on and off, but I really don't see a lot of difference in the artwork. You can play with the sliders here and you'll see you get fewer anchor points and maybe not as much accuracy and you can dial it up here all the way up to 100%. And even in that case, we're still getting rid of some anchor points. So play with this slider to get the best result from your artwork and then click OK. Next, what we'll do is take a look at saving some anchor points on this artwork here. Let me zoom out a little bit and I'll make a copy of this and this time I'm going to demonstrate using the plugin Astute Graphics has called Vector First Aid. Now this is a paid subscription, but it comes with a lot of plugins that do some wonderful things in Illustrator. So I think it's really worth checking this out. Now what I've done is I've switched over to another workspace that I already have set up a custom workspace. And this one allows me to see all of my Astute Graphics tools. So for this art here, Let's take a look and see how many anchor points we have. I'm using the document info panel and I'm here under objects and I can see that this flower outline here has 2,248 anchor points. All right, so we'll see what we can do with this using vector first aid. Now, the first thing I like to do is just with the art selected, run a check on it and just see what Vector First Aid can find here. A lot of interesting things like unnecessary handles, inconsistent point types, and on and on and on. And there's 10 unneeded anchor points here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click the Fix All button so that fixes everything that we saw in that list. And it removes some unnecessary handles and, and basically cleaned up this art in a very basic way. Now to go to another level of cleanup here, I'll go to this button and this is the super smart remove anchor points. And so what I'm going to do is hold down the option or alt key, and that will allow me to work with the settings here. So the tolerance setting by default is set to 20, but you can lower or raise this. If you really want to do an efficient removal of anchor points, I think 20 is a great place to start. Very often, if I have really super delicate art or I want something really just very fine, I'll go down to like five and you can get a great result from that. Let me go ahead and click okay. And we'll just do this at the default 
20 setting. And we can see right here, 1060 anchor points have been removed. So that's great. Let me go over back to my document info panel. And here, now we have 1178 where we did have 2000 and something. Let me go right here. Yes. So we've basically cut the number of anchor points in half and the artwork looks virtually the same. I can't really tell the difference. So that's Vector First Aid by Astute Graphics, one of my favorite plugins. And again, I can't recommend enough going through the process of optimizing your artwork, uh, because as I said before, once you bring this into pattern editing mode and you start moving it around and pattern editing mode is slowing down, uh, you definitely want to avoid that. So this is a first cleanup step that you can do to make your art function better in Illustrator after you've done image tracing or brought artwork like vector brushes in from Adobe Fresco. All right, so I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you like this video, share it with a friend. My name is Laura Coyle. I teach Adobe Illustrator to designers and artists. You can find out more on my website at lauracoylecreative.com. And thank you for watching.